Hey guys, don't mind how I look right now. Um, I just got back from my parents' house and grocery shopping. I went to see them one last time before baby girl comes. Um, sorry about the lighting, I'm in the nursery and it doesn't have the best lighting. But what I'm gonna do right now is, I already have the car seat in my car, but I need to go through the hospital bags and since it is winter here where I live and very cold, um, I need to go through our hospital bags, there's Percy, um, and figure out what I need to take out and put in my purse or another small bag that I can bring into work with me when I work or bring where I'm going um, so it doesn't freeze in the car if there are things that shouldn't be freezing in the car. So I'm going to go through and figure out what I can leave in my car and figure out what I need to put in my purse or in a small bag. I think that I forgot to mention I'm planning on doing a week in my life video, um, just a vlog of the last little bit of me being pregnant. I'm currently, tomorrow will be 36 weeks pregnant, so I have my last monthly appointment tomorrow morning, and then I start my weeklies the Monday after, so maybe I'll do a quick bump shot for you guys. But this is me at 30, pretty much 36 weeks pregnant. So she has definitely dropped quite a bit. So yeah, this is little girl at 36 weeks. We can't wait to meet her. Hey guys, so I ate dinner and showered and I've been working on doing a recommendation letter for um, one of the people that used to work for me. And um, so I've been working on that. Tomorrow I have a doctor's appointment. I think I mentioned that already, but it's just like the last monthly doctor's appointment before we start the weeklies. So I have that tomorrow. Um, I work tomorrow and I'll be leaving work and going to the appointment and then going back to work. What else? Oh, I'm watching Bridgerton. I am I love that show it's so good I'm definitely very addicted to it and I've really been enjoying it so if you haven't checked out Bridgerton make sure you go ahead and check that out so yeah okay so I just got home from work it is Tuesday no just kidding it's Monday I started this on Sunday just got home from work and um, I went to work this morning I worked technically at 5 but I went in at like 4:30, um, and then I had a doctor's appointment at eight, so I had to leave work and go to my doctor's appointment. It was like a 50 minute drive to my doctor's appointment and then go back to work. And then after work, I stopped and got an oil change. So that's been what I've done so far. Um, Paul made, I had hamburger or venison thawing for chili tonight, but Paul, saw and made hamburger helper so we'll eat that for dinner and then I'm gonna make the chili and then we'll freeze some and then have some for leftovers as well so I will show you guys how I make my chili I can't remember if I've shown you how I make my chili I'll go back and look and see in my videos if I've shown you already I'm not gonna show you again okay I changed into something a little bit cute so that we can take a um, bump date picture but Paul's playing video games so I have to wait till he's done with a round or whatever it's called but um in the meantime i looked it up and i did show you a chili recipe but i showed you an instant pot one so i'll show you a crock pot one now so i'm browning the venison right now um we're actually gonna double the recipe because i had one pound of venison out and i decided to take out a two pound thing and thought two pound thing so i have to double the recipe so, browning the venison, and then, so I'll just tell you guys the measurements for a um, two pound, or like a doubled recipe. So, in a single recipe, you will just you would just want one thing of chili tomatoes and one thing of tomato sauce, but since I'm doubling it, I have two each. And then for a single one, you just want two cans of rinsed dark red kidney, kidney beans, but I have four because I'm doubling it again. So I'm gonna get those all in the crock pot. Okay, so the recipe calls for two cups of water, but I did not do two cups of water because, um, well, I did, I did two, but like I'll show you, it's pretty watery. 
already. I did two, three, three, just over three cups of water. Um, so I have that going. And then the chili seasoning that I added, it calls for one chili packet, um, or a packet of chili. So what I used was this Penzi's Chili 9000, and I used like two tablespoons of this, so. Okay, I decided I'd actually have leftover Indian food from when I went to visit my parents. So it's just a uh, buttered chicken, and then um, naan. Got some watermelon there. So that is going to be my dinner today. Oh, and then I think I forgot to mention the chili. You, I'm gonna do it on high for four hours. Otherwise, I think you could do on low for six to eight. Okay, so I just thought I'd show you guys. That's about half of the chili. The rest I put in containers in the freezer. But yeah, made lots and lots of chili. Hey guys, if I look a little tired, it's because I am. It is four o'clock and I just got home from work. I went to work. I left for work at four o'clock, so been 12 hours since I've been home um, but I am going to hop in the shower before Paul gets up and wants to shower too so I am going to hop in the shower quickly hey guys so it is currently the next day I went to bed at like 8 o'clock last night it was great and I slept till like 8 30 this morning um, I did have to let the dogs out once but it was amazing to sleep that much <clears throat> I work at noon today we have open interviews so I'll be interviewing like people that walk in all day um, so nothing too crazy, hopefully. And then, what else? Um, yeah, it is currently 9.30. Maybe I'll get ready for work. I don't know last time I wore makeup for work, but I don't know. Maybe I won't, I don't know. Wearing mask and makeup is not really fun. Sorry if the lighting is a little bad. I'm currently in my garage. Um, I'm about to go to work again. Um, so last night I got home kind of late around like 10 30 from work um it ended up being a long day at work but that's all right um i came home and i went to bed right away and then i woke up this morning around seven ish it's currently nine o'clock and i'm going back to work i work 10 to 7 tonight um so i'll probably come home and go to bed because i work at 5 a.m tomorrow which means i get there at about 4 30 so I have to leave my house at like four o'clock, so it'll be a long day tomorrow. Um, I've also got a haircut appointment tomorrow, um, so I'll be leaving work early, so yeah. Hey guys, sorry I haven't vlogged more. Um, today was a pretty rough day at work. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on. If you can see, I've got dry shampoo in my hair. I just took a body shower, but today was a really rough day at work. Um, just a lot of stuff going on there, um, so. I came home and needed to just relax with Paul before he went to work and then um, showered and now I'm gonna go to bed it's 7 30 but I'm gonna watch some YouTube in bed and go to bed because I have to work at 5 tomorrow sorry my arm is tired <laughs> um, I work at 5 tomorrow which means I really work at like 4 30 because I go in early um, for me being on time is late so yeah, I work at 5 tomorrow, so I'll be leaving the house before probably 4 o'clock because we have bad weather right now. And yeah, my flowers from Walmart still look pretty, so that's good. That's something cheerful. But it was, it was a long day, so um, I actually ended up leaving early because of the roads as well, so... I still had plenty of hours for this week, so I didn't have to take any vacation out, so that's kind of nice, but yeah, I was I was ready to leave. Hey guys, it is currently Sunday. I didn't think, I don't think I filmed anything yesterday, but basically I worked and um, came home and went to bed. I apologize that <laughs> this week wasn't more exciting. I might start another week in my life because I actually have two days off this week instead of none. I literally am on day seven. Today was day seven in a row of working, and tomorrow will be day eight, so maybe I'll start another vlog. But thank you guys so much for watching, and if you enjoyed it, make sure you subscribe to stay tuned for more. We are going to be 37 weeks pregnant tomorrow with little baby girl, so yeah. Subscribe if you want to stay along for the ride.